Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Rachel and I am just recording a video about the things I have recently bought for my house. I'm decorating a room and it's gonna be like plant themed, really green, lots of cool elements, um, a lot of vintage stuff, but also some newer pieces. And yeah, I'm super excited. I went to Home Goods. TJ Maxx and I went thrifting at some vintage stores. So I'll just show you what I got. I'm gonna like lump Home Goods and TJ Maxx together because they're basically the same thing. So the first thing I bought that I'm really excited about is this planter. Um, this was $13 from Home Goods and it is this beige planter that has some black speckles on it. Um, it has a water holder thing at the bottom, which is great and um, it allows for water streaming. So I'm excited about this. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna put that plant in here, um, which I'm really excited about. And yeah, that's the first piece. Okay, here's the next item that I'm really excited about. So it's this purple glass jar. Uh, it's 100% recycled glass. This was $5. I just really liked it. I thought it was an interesting shape. And I just, I liked the purple. I thought it would go really well with the green elements in the room. And yeah, I'm pretty stoked about it. Um, something about me with decor is that I like useful items. I find it really difficult to buy items that have no use. Um, I just, I don't understand it. And so I always try to find something, find things that have a use. So like I could potentially put some cuttings in there for them to grow and yeah, just an idea I had for that. The next item I have kind of continues with the purple theme. This was from TJ Maxx. This is one that I kind of immediately grabbed as soon as I saw it. I just thought the coloring on this was so beautiful. It's this purple color, a like darker than a lavender. It has speckles on it and then it has like this sun um the sun texture it's textured it's bumpy and i just thought it was super cute so again this will go i think nicely with the purple boy over there and this one was relatively inexpensive as well this was eight dollars i do love to go to home goods and tj maxx for my planners i think that they have great quality things there for cheap so that's another one the next item I am super excited about, it's noisy. Let's see. Okay, so what we have here is this wind chime. It has like, it's made of a bowl, brassish, goldish material, and at the bottom are these bells. So I just thought this would be really nice. I don't think I'm gonna put it in this room. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it on our front porch. Um, I just think it'd be really beautiful. I'm really excited about it. Looks like this bent. Okay, there we go. I fixed that. Okay, and the next one is a painting. It's some wall art. I wasn't sure if I wanted it because it kind of clashes with the colors I was thinking of going with in this room, but I just thought it was so pretty. And yeah, I just really liked that. So it's this here. I like the colors of the sky at the top. I just thought it was really nice. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure if it's gonna go in here or somewhere else because I have a lot of older style art in this room right now. Um, like I'll show you when I do this room tour when it's finished. But I just thought it was super nice. This was just $30. It was a pretty good steal. And I even like left it there while I browsed the store as I was trying to decide if I wanted it. And I ended up deciding I wanted it. So. It's mine now. So another item is this planter. It's a smaller planter. I'm actually resting the camera on there. This one was $6 off of something else. And I just thought it was a smaller, a nice smaller one for a plant. And now we have two items that I'm also really excited about. So I found this candle in the clearance section. I thought the glass was really nice. Um, this was just $3. It smells like something magnolia maybe i don't know but i just thought it was cute and expensive and would be a cute useful decor item the next one um i'm always looking for more candles i have 
candles that go with each theme of the room um and i'm just in there sniffing candles all the time what can i say oh this one's tight okay so there's this other candle i purchased it's tea tree okay there we go and it has a wood wick as you can see there and it just smells amazing it smells so good what can i say it just smells so good mm. So those are the last items I purchased from TJ Maxx and Home Goods. Okay, so now we're gonna move to a few items that I purchased from a thrift store. Um, let's see. So we'll start with these two items here. I have these two framed photos, not photos, framed pieces of framed prints of blue-throated saber rings and Wagler's hummingbird um, so we have those two here they're matching and these are gonna be hung somewhere in the room as I said these are kind of an older style of image that's kind of what I was going for but again when I saw that one I just needed it so I'm not sure what I'm gonna do about that yet so another item I purchased I didn't know what this was I think it's like supposed to be hung on a wall I'm gonna remove that. I just thought it would be a really good like water catcher for a bigger pot that doesn't have um, that doesn't have its own like water catcher. What are they called? Saucers. Um, so this was actually just two dollars on sale. It's fifty percent off. It does have has some markings. It's a little bit older, but it's just going to hold water. And I just thought the border was really pretty so excited about this one okay i think the last item is right here it's already hung up jake and i hung it up last night there's this framed print of this magnolia that i purchased it has some damage here so i'm just going to spray paint this gold but the rest of the gold just kind of has the rest of the frame just has uh, a little bit of wear which i think is fine um the last item that i thrifted was this record table it's really interesting i won't show you at all right now um but it's obviously really worn so i'm gonna pull all of this off and then i'm gonna sand it down to make it smooth and then i'm gonna restain it to a different color but basically i have been potting on this white table which has not been good I needed a gardening potting table, so this is it. And I'm really excited about this piece as well. Anyway, uh, thank you everyone so much for watching. I really appreciated it. Um, let me know what y'all thought of my purchases down below. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you received some inspiration for your decorating. And yeah, talk soon.